come back to my um, uh, HID ballast setup with uh, DC DC converters of like 10 uh, 12 volts. Uh, the 150 watt uh, HQITS uh, Osram uh, uh, metal halide lamp with a short arc high density discharge and my trusty 5 volt LED power supply, or at least now it's set to 5 volt, uh, to activate the optocoppler, which is the enable signal, and we're not reading out the power good signal. The only modification that I did to the board, which is currently not energized, um, is. Uh, I'm trying not to point it out where it is. Uh, so there are uh, current sense resistors. There are one ohm each, and they are all paralleled. And you have six in parallel for the current sense of the PFC stage, and uh, formerly four parallel um, one ohm resistors for the um, uh, HID driver um, current sense. And I added just um, a fifth uh, one ohm resistor in a, um, a suitable package. That's uh, um, 12.06 and uh, hopefully this will um, modify the, the current that the circuit sees in such a way uh, that it's uh, willing to drive the lamp at the proper current uh, because previously I ran the lamp for some time and then uh, it just uh, it just uh, turned off because the pressure rises and thus uh, the voltage rises and the current decreases and um, the uh, driver circuit cannot sustain the current of the lamp so, let's see what happens. As you see, the multimeter is missing, so I, I trust that the PFC stage is still working. And the lamp ignites. And it might be fooled into this, but I, I think the flickering is much less. Uh, you can still see it pulsating. Uh, it's still unstable, but um, we'll see if it uh, if it um, stays on and if it stabilizes. Right now, it's still flickering. I'm not sure if you can see this on camera, but it's still flickering. Unfortunately, I cannot measure the current, so. Just see how it goes. Brightness is pretty high now. It's really high, and the lamp, lamp gets more stable as it gets hotter. That's actually a good sign. So I'm currently I'm, I'm overdriving the um, the, the uh, driver board by 20 percent, but I hope that uh, they. Um, oh. Obviously they didn't. So as you can see, the lamp turned off again, and we can, we could, in principle, restart it, but um, yeah. See, it doesn't ignite. So the pressure is too high for the circuit. Well, bad luck. So I have to find a 120 or 100 watt uh, HID lamp that goes with this driver board, and then you can modify the current in the other direction. Okay, thanks for watching.